Hey everybody, it's that time again. It is time for another episode of the Happy and Healthy Hump Day. Here I am in Rose on Hump Day. And today I'm gonna be talking to you about makeup. Actually, May is a month of makeup. And today is Bare Minerals. Bare Minerals is a company that I've used for the last three or four years. And actually this is called Complexion Rescue. I have used this actually only for a few months, but I have used uh, Bare Minerals for four or five years. This actually has SPF 30 in it. So whenever you're putting it on your face, you actually get a little SPF in it. So, <clears throat> excuse me. This little bottle has 28 ingredients, five of which I think you need to be aware of. All right, those five are butylene glycol, and this is a, a petroleum byproduct. Petroleum byproduct. Oh, that does not sound very good at all. And really, it dissolves into the skin very, very quickly, and that's the main reason it's on this list is because it, it penetrates the skin very quickly, and it's a petroleum byproduct. So that's one ingredient. Second ingredient that you should be aware of, aware of and that is because of irritants, is called propanediol. Sorry, again, these are difficult pronunciations, but um, this is a viscosity decreasing agent and it can be irritating to both the skin and the eyes as well. And since makeup is worn around the eyes, that's why you're, you could be worried that it is an irritant. All right, next, and these are probably more, you should be more aware of these three because of the potential risk that these cause. Um, these are all organ neurotoxicity or reproductive. Uh oh. So in all of these I will say any times that any time that studies have found these ingredients associated with organ or neurotoxicity or reproductive issues, it's because people have been exposed or in one case animal um, rats have been exposed to very high doses. So it's not likely that this would occur here, but still, magnesium chloride and um, yeah, magnesium chloride, polysorbate 60, that is another one, reproductive issues, tumor formation, and that's a thickening agent. And then the last one is potassium chloride, it's also a thickening agent, and this was actually used in Dr. Kevorkian's suicide cocktail. Oh my goodness, uh, it's considered low hazard ingredients when it's just a small amount but um and found in your makeup but again it can cause um cancer neurotoxicity organ system toxicity and other endocrine damage so those are definitely four to be aware or five ingredients to be aware of one good thing that is in this small little bottle is a, an ingredient called squalene and actually what squalene does is it absorbs into the skin very quickly good uh, not neither good nor bad. It is an antioxidant, good thing. It prevents UV damage and actually prevents these brown spots that you might see right there on my face, uh-oh, um, age spots. It also is antibacterial, so another good thing. And other studies have actually shown that it can reverse the damage that other chemicals do. So by having this squalane or squalene, they're actually the same ingredient, but they're spelled two different ways it can possibly reverse damage from other ingredients. So, that's a good thing. Now, next, this little bottle, this Complexion Rescue has 16 different shades, ranging from Opal 1 to Sienna 10 for anybody um, who is either very ivory, pale skinned, or very dark skinned. Price is $29.50 for 1.18 ounces, and you can get this at Sephora, Ulta, of course online at the Bare Minerals site, Fun fact, all the makeup that Bare Minerals produces is formulated without parabens, which is good. It doesn't have any binders. It doesn't have any fillers. And they actually have won the 2016 Glammy Award winner. So do I look very glamorous? Uh, they also have the Best Tinted Moisturizer in 2015 and 2016 and the Allure Best of Beauty Award. So for the Best Tinted Moisturizer. So this is actually a really good product. Yay or nay, would I buy it? I'll be honest, this is a tricky one for me. I will definitely use it. And I'm gonna show you how to, that I use it every day. I'll definitely finish the bottle. Um, the reproductive issues cause me a little concern. So 
I'm looking for something a little more natural than this, something that doesn't have any ingredients that potentially cause reproductive issues, hormone, endocrine issues, and things like that. So without further ado, I'm gonna show you how to use this, and actually you just use your fingertips. So I'm gonna turn the camera around a little bit. It's still me, it's still me. And actually, I have my makeup on already for the day. Um, I've had it on all day, so you might not could tell anything. Um, I mean, you can, you definitely can see that. This smooths into my skin very easily, very well. And really what it does is it keeps me from looking really oily and greasy all day while also giving me that SPF coverage. So I do really like the product. Um, I don't feel like a lot of it comes out on my fingers or anything. But anyway, um, that's today's issue of the Happy and Healthy Hump Day. Tune in next time in two weeks for another episode on makeup. And this will actually be Therapy Systems, which is a small batch um, company here in Nashville. So anyway, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget, subscribe. Thank you. Have a good weekend. Bye-bye.